Welcome back to the channel guys, uh, just a player video for you now, um, I've got uh, some good news for the playing moon boys, it does seem that we are getting a breakout now uh, for player, so a lot of potential upside for player at the moment, um, we're on the 4 hour, we need to see this candle body close in the next uh, half an hour roughly, All right, above this level, we won't want to see it wick back down underneath this level. But it does look like we are on track for that at the moment. If you look on the one hour, as you can see, we've got a few closes outside of there. So yeah, player does look like it's ready to take a leap or a jump to the upside. All right, you can see we've got some overhead resistance over here at this level around the 165 mark. We've also got another overhead resistance just a little bit above that at the 180 mark. If we can blast through that and um, come above this level and create a higher high above that level and find support anywhere over here between these two lines then we could see um you know a nice price rise to the upside um another target would be uh over here at this level obviously that's the uh a local top if you take out that wick over there if we do break that level then you know there's not you know not much resistance overhead apart from that we can see it like uh, really make make a big move to the upside if we're talking about um this target here then even from now if you were to buy the breakout then from now we're looking at uh, 40 45 percent almost 50 percent move to the upside i would like to see it break that and continue to the upside obviously player is very cheap and you can pick up a lot of player right now and um it would be nice to see some more volume, uh, to be honest. But I think that there will be a follow through. I don't see why not. And um, yeah, hopefully we can see some fireworks in player. So yeah, some of you guys should be happy about that. If we look on the Bitmark chart, of course, um, it is lagging a little bit behind by like two points. It's 148 over here and it's 146 over there for the sake of time i was in ocean x anyway and for the sake of you know two points i just bought it here you know i could have got it cheaper slightly 146 and 147 for the amount that i got um but you know i mean it's one point it's, it's one or two points you know nothing to sniff at you know would like to see some volume over here as well but i do think we could get a follow through considering the fact that it has been correcting for all of this time I would I would expect a swift move to the upside at this point uh, but I could be wrong at the end of the day guys you have to do your own research if we alter the line like that it would suggest that it hasn't quite uh, broken out yet but um, that is uh, it is expected that it's gonna push through that that, that level and once it does I reckon we might see some momentum to the upside as well. It doesn't translate that way on the uh, on the the Ocean X chart. I haven't actually had a look at the VT pairing, so I might as well do that uh, before I go as well. Okay, we've got clear. Bear with me. All right, so we've got player VET. What's going on? Okay, it doesn't seem to be working out for me, guys. Let me just open another page, see if that makes a difference. P-L-A-V-E-T Okay, appear to be having some technical difficulties on the Ocean X chart uh, Ocean X uh, technical difficulties, but yeah, on the um, on the VET chart 
it is looking very bullish as well actually to be honest we've got uh, we've got a bullish macd cross as well on the four hour and uh yeah everything's looking looking quite well we need to see these moving averages flip uh, do, do a flip and change direction but it does look like that could be coming very soon the rsi was oversold and it's being bought back up you can see it's slowly in an uptrend all right guys we need to break this resistance on the on the vt chart as well uh, overhead resistance once we break that level then you know um hopefully there could be uh blue sky breakout that would be nice wouldn't it all right guys uh so yeah going back to the uh btc chart yeah, I guess that's it for now. We we'll go back to Bitmart. We we'll say that's it for now, guys. Um, we have had a breakout technically, uh, but if we draw the line differently, it would suggest that it's not broken out. If we draw it, draw it like that, not on Bitmart, but it has on OceanX. But if we get a breakout of there, then it's definitely just a final confirmation of this move to the upside. All right, guys. So yeah, that's clear. Um, get your moon bags out. Get your moon boots on. All right, guys. And uh, yeah, that's it for now. If you haven't subscribed to the channel. Please do uh, let me know what you think in the comments as well and I guess I'll see you again in the next one.